not a lot. Hi, welcome back to the vlog. Today is the first day back to the track. So all this talk we've had about a soft start and like using that term to justify justify our eating habits out the window. This is the start start. This is the hard start. So we're back on the program. Uh, today it's just like tempo 45 second runs. Uh, what did Vicky eight, say? Eight, eight to ten 45 second runs with two minutes rest between each. Hopefully it's a walk two minutes and not jog two minutes recovery because everybody knows there's nothing worse than a jog recovery. So it's been hotter these past couple days than like the whole summer. Um, up north it was like 35 with the Humidex and I guess down here it's been like 40 and today's another day that it's like 40. So we live in an upstairs apartment so you can just imagine how hot it is and now we're going to the track and like I'm sitting here in air conditioning and I think I'm getting pitters already so <laughs> you could just base it off that. That's why I choose to wear all black. That, that makes zero sense. Okay, it makes no sense in the fact that it'll make me hotter but at least you won't see my sweat. Oh. And you don't wear anything with pits. Oh yeah, and I never wear shirts that have sleeves, if you may have noticed. Gotta show the guns. Gotta hide mine. Oh my gosh, I know I've already said this like every single video since we started training, but I am insanely out of shape right now. I don't think it's ever been this bad. Anyways, apparently I was only supposed to do six, because I think my coach recognizes that I'm a bit of a roly-poly at the moment. So I did six, and Taylor's just finishing up right now. He just did his eighth, so I'm waiting to see if he goes for goes for the larger end of the range. This is not forever. Folks changing like the weather. That's it, Taylor. regret nothing in my off season. <laughs> That's good. Do you regret the fact that we had chips for dinner last night? I don't regret anything. I'm surprised at how well I felt, actually. So I don't think I lost that much fitness in the off season. Nobody likes a bragger. Nobody likes a bragger. So, but it felt good. That's good. Did you do 10? So it turned into like 10 times 250? 250-ish, give or take, on each rep, but on average, 250. It's not even like my legs that were sore, it was like... That was, just that was like a rough breathing. one, cardiovascularly. Yeah. Cardiovascularity, so. From a cardiovascular standpoint. It was harder. Just like, yeah, I didn't like, I don't feel lactic. It's just, it's just very hard to breathe. 
any and all athletes out there, I want to know if when sweat drips down into your eyes, does it feel like you just poured salt and tequila in them? Because mine do all the time. And my lips get super dry. How about you? I don't sweat. Women don't sweat. Let me know if this is a regular thing for everybody else. Because my eyes feel probably red. When I was in high school, I would um, sweat through my shirt so quickly that on lunch breaks, I would have to put them under the hand dryer and my friend would stand on watch at the door. So when I say I don't sweat, really, that's what I mean. I sweat a lot. I just got this banana protein. Really good. Banana protein, rivalous, get it. Telvin, if you're watching this, can you tell your brother to stay away from my fiance? It's way too close. Way too close. All right, so we're back now. Um, like we said, good workout. Um, I know I'm sweaty. My camera just died. Um, but like I was saying, Good workout. Uh, we're finally back working out with the uh, Western track and field team. Um, you'll see them more in other workouts. Like we have like a circuit tomorrow, so you'll see that. And now we're gonna get back to kind of eating healthy, unfortunately. So we usually do a eat healthy for the uh, for the week and then we usually have pizza on like Saturday or Sunday or something so we're gonna get back to that getting back into it feeling good looking forward to it and see you guys tomorrow